Hello, I'm Satoshi Yamamoto. Welcome back to my time bench. Uh, today I'd, I'd like to do a pattern um, that has been my uh, box. I've been using this past couple of years and then uh, being on the list of a uh, 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 video, but I haven't done it in a while. Um, finally, I got a time. Um, uh, what I call this is what I call uh, Web Mayfly, like a website uh, that stands for uh, Wiggly. Uh, extend the body um, this is PMD at the end I'd like to show you uh, brewing uh, brewing olive version base version and then let's get started hook I use here is Daiwiki 125 uh, I'm using a size 16 but I'm sure 18 is fine and you see uh, why um, I can use a really a smaller hook make a nice thread base here with a 16 or thread and then okay for the extender body what I use is just a, um, a piece of a, a stretchy you know uh, this life flex from hairline or just the uh, lava is fine and then probably you've seen my uh, um, two mix salmon fry which I use a yarn to twist and then in that case I use this um, uh, use this uh, um, you know hemostat you know but this is just a uh, one uh, stretch yarn I'm sorry stretch uh, um, uh, uh, super frost basically oh yeah super frost I forgot to say that um, um, it just a ring and a hack play uh, is fine it doesn't ruin you know each other so um, okay so exactly the same method one hand goes doesn't matter either right hand or left hand okay your right hand or left hand one hand goes twist away from me away from you and then the other hand twist toward uh, you twist toward me and then do this at the same time like that okay you can gently pull But not hold a lot, you don't have to uh, put a hole a lot, okay? And make a really tight, um, really tight uh, uh, turns. Okay, now here, just in the middle, push the finger, or you could, uh, if you could grab a, uh, a bodokin or a needle or something, you could, uh, what I usually do is, I just pick up here in the middle, and then let them, twist as such I think it's a bit too short for uh, to show in the camera here you go uh, bit too, bit too, bit too short at this point but I uh, it, it's long enough okay let me show you it, this part is a uh, slightly messy uh, to do in front of the camera but I'm gonna attach I leave this a uh, hacker prior uh, then make I'm tying just about the end of you know ba uh, thread base and then now I made a three turns so I can't let this go then I did drop this uh, wingly body here extend the body here and then before I let it get to secure further more I proceed this uh, um, waist end all the way to the eye here we go This is kind of st st uh, sticking up, but uh, it will be okay. Okay, now I'm gonna adjust the uh, angle of the hook. So um, it's going to be, uh, uh, this part is uh, flat. Okay, uh, what I do next is, I mean, certainly, you know, uh, one can cut off here and then. Uh, I don't know, hako or wing or you can do whatever but uh, um, what I do next is this is uh, another you know, this is another pattern based on my stream observation um, I'm going to make the eye I just cut off a small piece from just a um, regular two millimeter form uh, gray and I'm going to make the eye 
it's not really needed but the uh, since we can do it um, and there's enough materials and the space to do do so so I'm going to imitate the uh, um, eye so I put the eye uh, this is a really seam, maybe a one millimeter by one millimeter, you know, square. If you find, if you can, if you have like a, a round, you know, um, a cylinder type form, that would be great. Um, or like a monofilament or something of a miscellaneous colors, that would be great. And then make sure this side is really tight. Here you go. I I just fold back this uh, waist end here and the dropping of this uh, form here we go make a good good uh, good uh, good drop all the way back to where I uh, tied in this uh, yeah, wingly body okay okay I might as well first tie in uh, trim this uh, yeah, waist end here since I'm holding here we go then uh, since this is sticking so I might as well trim this uh, eye. You can adjust this eye later on. You don't want to look like a damsel fry. So just, just like that. So now you got the eye, we got the eye here. And then the one uh, wingly body sticking out, kind of, you know, pressed down. So rest is really easy. Uh, certainly, I have not done yet, but uh, um, uh, one can add like a rubber legs or something, and then I just I can tell you right now I just had a CDC wing and then the uh, hack wraps. Okay, my usual method to stack and then like, to just to obtain the you know fibers out of a CDC. Uh, type 3, you know, inexpensive, um, inexpensive, um, uh, bulk CDC. I wrap really well. I leave this end for now. I just trim the button first. Oh, good. I don't know. <laughs> I don't knock over the eye. So, okay. Conceal the button here. And then, might as I trim the, um, wing right now. Try to shoulders and uh, um, shoulders and uh, extended body. Then I got a uh, whiting is um, silver grade saddle hako. I made a four turns uh, up to right behind the uh, um, head eyes of the three or four turns should be fine and then I'm going to whip finish and the fry is done apparently this is very uh, brilliant but but uh, it still looks very natural in the water. I have tested, um, I have fished, as always, I fished at the Spring Creek. This one just works. And then lastly, this one's kind of sticking out here. I like to trim the uh, um, bottom flat, bottom hackles flat. Here we go. This is my uh, uh, wingly extended body uh mayfly and this is Bailey's so I'd like to show you uh this is the uh oh this is sorry this is a hook player is made for um is a adjuster for the salmon fry display so this is the uh Bailey's Bailey's pattern with a red eye this is actually meant to be uh uh um meant to be uh, like a male you see this uh, red eyes on this um uh saturn you know blue wing and the spring creek and then um apparently i'm using a dark out dark olive ring olive um um uh, 
super frost and this is even smaller uh, with a gray eye like a female and i'm using a lighter uh, lighter cdc either one just fine uh, works just fine and then uh, looks really well on the water and then i have not tried larger larger species than uh, pmd um because i think this uh material is a bit thinner uh to to be a uh, green drake so let's see i might try someday um green drake or march brown or uh other species around here you know i may come up with something but uh, this is uh web uh, web mayfly uh for sure that i'm using for uh spring creek during the uh mayfly hatch again those uh two major hatches on spring creek so pmd and uh blue wing babies so uh yeah uh try this pattern and then let me know how it works so uh thank you for watching